Well, we do see Kirk getting in towards Beke. Beke taking low. Howling Gale once again to the rescue from Enrated. I'm starting to put that on record message and uh, leave it going for later on. The answer phone message will be, <laughs> sorry, Enrated just saved you. Is he going to get the shot? And as he does, it gets Beke down. I cannot believe it. They sent and went back. And there was a ward that Arunea had put there to try and safeguard too early time. on. Oh, Arunaid oh, goes in, he's got the kick available, boot Sinai back, that's going to be the Shadow Dash, and sure enough, here comes Graton. Why not get yourself another kill, son? Because you are dominating. 6-1-5, the KDA continues to explode for Graton. For 10 years, and it looks like up in the top lane, Pharrell Lord's gone on Charu. A big 1v1 here is going to come out on top of this one right now. It's looking like Pharrell and Lord Charu is going very, very low, couldn't quite get him down. And that will be Pharrell Lord pretty much saying, well, I can do this kind of thing. Uh, and then hit them. Teleport's coming in from Troy. He's motoring. Oh, he's got the home guard boots on there and he's going to try and get in on top of Ferelon Lord. But look at that. Popped. Kill. And Kreppo said, if I'm going down, I'm taking you with me. Laying the hook on him, kept in there. But it's a very stupid getting two crucial kills that he doesn't necessarily need. Expect he's going to chase down the other Pete here. Oh he's my god. Pace, throws out the stun card, goes into wild card, ignites down. But barrier from Pete, is it going to be enough to turn it around? No, it's not. That Leech Pain doing work for Peke. Oh, that was like a next level play right there because he popped his ultimate a little bit earlier and then just went ahead of him after the gold card hit. But Froggen's coming in. He's not spotted yet. He could take Xpeke down. He's going to throw out. He's going to face shot. Can he get enough damage down on towards him? The wall is available. Available, uses it to try and get a vision. One more shot comes out there. There it is. Oh, he gets the stun guard back on Froggen. And you can see Pekka, he's going to try and get away from this one. The bird is so slow moving. But Cyanide, Cyanide is closing the gap. He's coming towards Pekka. And another wild card lands. He could turn around. He doesn't want to chase this one through. And now you can see Cyanide's going to slide in. He gets him down. There's going to be the passive from Froggen. He is going to be an egg on the floor. And that is simply going to be a runny man. They could turn this one around. Pekka trying to get away from him. Monsoon from n -rated. Some great plays coming out from both teams. In the meantime, Fnatic is going to be going for Dragon here. They do have Cyanide, he has Smite, he has Consume. Kirby's going to be here to try to stop it. And they oh, get it! Oh, he's got it! And he gets away with the safeguard. Is it going to be enough? No, but the laser comes across. Kerb comes in. He gets one. Cyanide taken incredibly low. Kratom on Yellowstar. Cyanide's going to come in, tries to bait it around. Yellowstar in trouble. Kerb gets on towards him. That's a double kill. Yeah, he's sticking around. He doesn't want to let this happen. And he stole already earlier on today, or in the first the first dragon. He might be able to do it again. Well, we'll see whether he does. All the Q was landing. Didn't go for it. They stole oh, it! Kratom stole it with a piercing arrow. Good God, that is every single dragon they've stolen now. Oh my wow. word. They're going to push middle lane and engage in their fight before uh, Fnatic can get up towards the top side and help out. And now they're going for a push on this middle turret and it's 12 to 4 now. The hole barely missing. And Xpeki taking still tons of damage. It's still taking tons of damage. For Ellen Lord has that laser. That's going to be the shockwave though. Jerry pulled into that one. Ice Blast comes out. There's the light binding. He comes around oh. the side. And Aranea comes in. Spins on the kick. Elite Syndrome working in effect for Aranea. But this time it's successful. I, I feel like Alton is playing on an entirely different level from every LCS team at this moment. Yellowstar is now getting dope. Yellowstar caught out. He's using the barrier, but it's not going to be enough. So has come swinging in. That's Kraton going down on the turret, and he may be able to turn onto Kerp here. Kerp in trouble. Cyanide comes around. The passive shield's not going to be enough. Back and forth. The it? action go. Light binding laser. Down towards Soas. My god, I can't believe this game. Aaron is in trouble as well. Cyanide's coming in there. Has to use the iron turn. Kicks him away, and Soas gets bounced. Jerry takes down and rated. The rest of Alton are coming around the side. Good god, what is going on in this game? Thanks for watching the weekly top 5 plays. Make sure to subscribe and visit esfiworld.com for more League of Legends coverage. But it looks like Damien we might finally have a little, little bit of a calm again. Get to relax, you get to, to breathe a little bit. I, I, I'll take over. You know what? Sit down I, and relax. I, I got this. You say sit down and relax. I am stood up. <laughs> He's standing this one. here. It's pretty warm oh, in here. Not, I'm not nope. going to lie. Nope. Nope. No. It's not. Just calm, calm down, guys. Calm. Okay, let's look at the items, Jason. Nope. No, no, Peck is chasing, chasing Howling Gale's coming in, Shockwave misses completely, it was a full-on Mare Wave there, and Peke gets caught, oh. he gets taken down low, but it's not going to be enough for Pirelli Lord yet, he's going to have a mountain of gold to go back and buy though. Okay, All right, it's going gonna, it's gonna to happen, alright, we're going to get our break, it's going to happen here, so let's go over items really quickly, and just as I say that, we do see Kirp invading.